Thousands of teachers, education, and technology enthusiasts in Atlanta in the middle of summer. Turn down for what? It must be summer school, and we're at ISTE 2014 with coverage brought to you by Classroom Mosaic at classroommosaic.com. Tales to go and at zipgrade.com. We're with Alan. What's the name of your company? Let's go education. And so you put robots in the classroom? We do. Tell us a little bit about your robots. Oh, this is an all new building system called Tetrix Prime. Tetrix Prime is based at a middle school level. It incorporates aluminum building channels, rechargeable battery packs, and servo motors. It's a very quick build, electrical uh, system and structural system. It uses uh, quick rivets to assemble the pieces and parts. There's very few screws, there's very few uh, extra tools that you would need to build. Very quick to build, very quick to take down in a single class period. So, um, <clears throat> so um, the middle school kids can build this, but obviously the younger kids can even control it? Absolutely, yeah, the operation is very, very simple. This is uh, very uh, beginning stages of robotics. Um, the aluminum channels and all of the structural components that are compatible with our high school system called Tetrix Max. Wow, and so is there a variety of different kits that you guys do, or? There is, we carry a variety of different kits. However, with one Tetrix Prime set, you can build up to three hero models with the same kit, plus whatever else the kids can imagine. Wow, so this is like a Rector set 5.0 or something, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. <laughs> Where can people find out more about, about it? Uh, you can find more at Pitsco.com or Tetrix Robotics. That was fast. ISD 2014 coverage brought to you by Tales to Go. It's the Netflix for children's audiobooks. Find them now in the iTunes App Store. Tech Faster is bringing you EdTech faster.